team is. Do you play him at the point? Do you play him at the two? But I can tell you this right now. When you put him out there opening night, he can go get buckets, Jerry. So this, the future is getting brighter and brighter for Houston because those two first-round picks they have this year, Jerry, are good players. Well, there's more than just two. In fact, there's four of them. And we'll get to see an additional one. We'll talk about that in a moment. Green, Alperin, Shen Gun has been sensational. If you like old school big man basketball, you'll get it with Shen Gun, who was taken with the 17th pick. Also making his NBA Summer League debut today, we've just learned the 23rd pick, Usman Garuba, coming back from the Olympics. We'll talk more about him when he enters the game. Let's go to the other side of this matchup. In Toronto, yes. a team you know really well, You've said you're the greatest coach in Raptors history. <laughs> Never. Stop. Nick Nurse argues. We'll talk to him. But Scotty Barnes, interesting pick. They surprised the world by taking him ahead of Jalen Suggs at number four. Well, they did. And, uh, and one of the reasons they probably made that pick there was Scotty Barnes. If you look at his size, six foot seven, six foot eight, his ball handling, playmaker skills. The only knock on Scotty Barnes is that he's not a, a shooter right now. But given the NBA, Given player development the way it is today, and all this young man, other skill set, he's going to be a keeper for this draft team. The question is, what kind of team they're going to build now in Toronto? Last night, Barnes just two for eight, 13 points in the Raptors' 90 to 84 loss to the Golden State Warriors. As I said, we're going to get to see him in a back-to-back -back here, Coach Mitchell. Thank you. 